Hey guys, hope you're enjoying the LA content. So after recording for about six hours, we decided to pop into a Ralph's to, you know, use the restroom and get some hydration and all that. And while we were waiting for the next car, a shady guy popped out of a dark alley and just handed me this random SD card. I don't really know what's on it yet, but hey, why don't we find out together, eh? All right, what do we have here? So this appears to be the main Waymo Depot in Los Angeles. As you can see, parking lot, whole bunch of Waymos and charge point stuff. By the way, if you haven't already seen the Autonomy Central video covering this depot, definitely go check it out. He actually gets a shot of the entrance from ground level. We're gonna be building on that video with some new footage here. So as we've seen in other depots and as indicated by the direction of cars and parking spaces, it looks like traffic flows in one direction. You've also got the regular staff members walking around, keeping tabs on the cars as they come in, and you know, that sort of thing. We've seen parking before, but let's back up and focus on this car for a bit. Looks like it's leaving to go join the fleet, right? Well, actually, it just circles around the block and re-enters the parking lot from the other side. Actually, hang on a sec. Was that human driven the whole time? I mean, it's not unheard of for Waymo to be able to drive around an indoor depot autonomously, but given the parking job there, I'm gonna say probably. And that brings us to the buildings. Given that we saw a car drive out of this one, and this one has a door open to the lot, are they even different buildings? I think it's safe to assume they probably have a regular base of operations going on here. Could be employee cafe, conference rooms, inventory, base vehicle maintenance, hardware repairs, etc, etc. Probably similar to what we saw in the Mesa Depot in Arizona. I actually did a tour of the Mesa Depot if you'd like to check it out up there, linked in the card. Sorry in advance, I was actually super nervous filming that and kind of froze up. I, I wish I could go back and try again with notes or something. Anyway, fun thing here, we get to watch them swap in a car for charging. I wonder if they have more charging infrastructure inside the building. And that brings us to the last thing I noticed in this footage from the shady SD card, which is that they appear to be using this rooftop lot over here for something. Overflow parking? I don't know. What do you think? Be sure to leave your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching.